we give a formal criterion of an adjoint functor. First recall that for a functor G, one, the forgetful functors U, B create limits which G preserves. And two, if the category I has an initial object zero, then for any diagram D, the limit of D is D zero. And three, the limit of the identity functor on a category A exists if and only if it is the initial object of the category A. The criterion states that a functor G is a joint if and only if one, G preserves all existing limits in A, and two, for each B object B, the limit of UB exists in A. For the forward direction, we have shown that adjoints preserve limits and that the object FB A to B is the initial object in the category B over G where F is the left adjoint to G. Thus by two on the right, the limit of UB is the object FB in the category A. Conversely, it is enough to show that for each B object B, the category B over G has an initial object. By one on the right and the hypotheses one and two above, UB creates the limit of the identity on the category B over G, and thus the limit of UB is equal to UB on the limit of the identity. Thus the limit of the identity on B over G exists, and by three on the right, we see B over G has an initial object, which completes the proof.